major anointings that is God has made available for all believers. The first is the believer's anointing, the individual anointing for your own personal Christian life. The second is the priestly anointing and that way you get baptized in the Holy Spirit. That anointing is for service, for the kingdom, for ministry, for service in the kingdom. You don't get baptized with the Holy Spirit and sit on the power. A power is for purpose. I wish we had time to discuss for the, some of the things that Pastor Randy taught us yesterday. It is an assignment first, purpose, then authority, and then on that authority is backed by power. The third is the dominion anointing, the kingly anointing. And this one, if you want to take cities, nations, if you want to take territories and their sphere and, and bring God's influence and dominion in it, you have to trust God for that. A ministry, sometimes they call it special anointing. Anybody that had national influence, city-wide influence, the cities break under their ministries and, and leadership, they broke in here. And people who operate from their territorial forces that rule cities and nations, territorial forces that rule the marketplace, that even rule governments, bow before them. If you want to know what Moses used to shake up the nation of Egypt and free the people, that is what it was. Thank God for the priestly anointing and all of that for serving in the house of God and doing reaching winning souls reaching doing all of that it has its limits but it will take you beyond where the individual one can take you 